So Declan Do Rice, fantastic. Yeah. Um, so no the question is, is he the best player outside the big six? <sighs> he's the best English player. Right, OK. Well, there's a start. As I've said, I, we got some fantastic players in that position. Is he better than Tillemans? I think so. Right. But that's your opinion. Yeah. So do, you, do you not? I, I can't split them. Spin really me around, spin me around, see if you change no, your mind. I can't split them. So, my five side team. Oh, you've personally. got your five side team. We'll jump straight into it. I've got mine as well. Yeah, Ariola. Pardon? Goal. Right, OK. Right. Rice and Tillemans. You play, you play Rice as a defender? Yeah. Them, yeah. Right. Him and Tillemans. Right. And then James Rodriguez. Zaha and Grealish. Oh, that's nice. Because uh, let's just say the rules here. You can't have two from the same team. That's correct. Right? So that and is they've got to be outside the top six. Oh, sorry, the big six. Yeah, the big six, not top six. No, not top six. But big the six. big six. And you can't have two from the same team. Yes. Yeah. I would have wanted Schmeichel in there, but I couldn't have Schmeichel because I've got Tillemans. Right. Do you want to hear mine? I've Go gone on. for Pope, Keane, Rice, Zaha and Vardy. I'm effectively playing two holders. <laughs> I'm not that I'll put Declan in the in There's the midfield. Winner, I've won that game as well. What's well, a Harm Vardy up top? I mean, I'll tell you what I was thinking about uh, putting in there. Um, obviously, Ings, Traore, right. and Wolves. Can imagine that? Yeah, um, but he wouldn't score goals. That would be the Madison, problem. right? Richarlison, mm, yeah. Calvert Lewin. If you wanted a centre forward, Calvert Lewin's a good call. Yeah, um, Rafinha at Leeds. Yeah. It's difficult, isn't it, to, to come up with your, your five-a-side team, but we're asking you to do that. And also, I want to talk about, just quickly, Declan Rice, right? How much is he worth? I love Declan Rice. I think he's a fantastic player. Of course, he's a fantastic player. I, I, How much would he go? I don't he's... even think it's a debate, but there will still be people on here. Yeah. You'll be amazed. There'll still be loads and loads of people on here who think Declan Rice is overrated. It, it no, does my nut. No, they there won't be. There is a won't lot. Be. You would, I promise you... It's a joke how many people will come on here and say he's rubbish. You won't get that now. You, you won't get will. That. Not that he's played for right. the last couple. There's one here now. Just come through on a text. Scott McTominay is better than Declan Rice. Yeah, but he's not saying Declan Rice is rubbish. He just thinks Scott McTominay's better. Well, he must be then. Why? Scott McTominay's better than Declan no, Rice. No, I'm not saying that. I, I think Declan Rice is top of the pile for that for that age, for that position. In the Premier League, I think he's a wonderful player. Would he, if he went, would he go for 100 million? Have West Ham got a 100 million pound player there? I don't think he'd be 100 million. Right. And do no. you think, you know, we're talking about Harry Kane, about he's got to go to further his career. Can the same be said for Declan Rice? Well, how old is he, Declan? 20, sort of 20 I think. Yeah. 20, is he only 20? Yeah. Well, is, I don't think he has to go now, does he? Oh, well, I don't know. I mean, should he be playing I Champions mean, West League? West Ham are having a fantastic season. Mm hmm. But yeah, it'll be, I would say that there is those ongoing talks with him, his family, uh, his agent, uh, the club. Oh, he's 22, he's 22. Yeah, yeah, the club, there's quite a lot going on, isn't there? And, and, and it could happen at any time. If the right big comes in, uh, I'm sure it will frustrate and annoy West Ham fans, but I think they're realistic enough to know. But if the right big comes in, they will sell mm. him.